now we're going to dress our kids. By the way, I can't say our kids. I just say your kids. It's not even stuck. This is the new school clothes. This is the back to school collection of what our young people are dealing with when they have to go to school. They are in war attire. They are wearing helmets. They are wearing fatigue. They are wearing caution tape. And this young lady is wearing a bullet proof vest. Three, two, one, bang! That is exactly what happened to my son. And what could happen to any son? And what happens to 90 people per day? 15 of them did. And what I'm doing right now is what happened to the other kids in that same school. They need to walk next to my dead son and next to the other 16 victims running away from danger. That's why we're here. And don't feel bad about me. Feel bad about them. What are we going to do to solve these problems? While I'm talking here, someone's getting shot and dying. And we don't do nothing. Sorry, we. I have a chance to wear a helmet that day. I made my son wear a helmet and a bulletproof vest. So he wouldn't get shot four times in the hall of the school. Is this how we're going to dress our kids? By the way, I can't say our kids. I just say your kids. Mine is dead. My wife as a mother is fighting for the other mother's kids. It's too late for us. It's not too late for you. Now we have a big chance to change this. It's November. So you better remember November. And go ahead out there and vote. And before voting, do your homework. Whoever is receiving money from the gun lobby doesn't deserve your vote. Vote them out! Vote them out! Vote them out! Vote them out!